Yes people, what is happening, how are we all doing and welcome back to the channel. In this video right here, we're going to be doing a full review of the brand new Lucky's Lighthouse Bundle. I'm going to be showing you every single thing that you can get as part of this set, giving it a full review and essentially telling you whether or not you should be buying it. So here you go people, this is the lighthouse right here, as part of this bundle it is 1000 V-Bucks from the item shop, you only get one build and I'm pretty sure it's 23 decor items that you get. So bit of a weird one, just the one build as part of this, uh, this bundle that you can get, so let's take a walk inside and it is exactly what you'd expect for a lighthouse, okay, loads of different floors but they're pretty much all exactly the same and you eventually go da 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 all the way up to the top, oh my god it takes forever. Don't even remember building all that. And then you have the giant light right there. And there's a little bit of like an outer edge thing here. A little ledge or a little balcony that you can look around. It is a very, very cool build. Don't get me wrong. One of the coolest and most unique we've probably had in LEGO Fortnite. Price is not too high as I've said. But remember you only get one build with this. So that is Lockie's Lighthouse right there. And this is the 23 decor items that we're going to take a look at right now. So starting off here, then you have got yourself a brand new bed. It's not bad, actually. Definitely better than quite a few of the beds that you get normally in LEGO Fortnite you unlock for free. Definitely more interesting than those ones, I would say. We then have a nautical-themed table. It's like a big steering wheel that you'd get on a ship. It even has the little, um, the little bits that stick out on the outside there. This is actually a stool, probably one of the more boring seating things we've got in LEGO Fortnite. We've got tons of amazing ones, but that is a, that is a really, really basic one. But if you're looking for a red and black colour scheme, it could go with that, I suppose. Kind of fits with the lighthouse. This is definitely one of the best decor items. This is essentially the giant light that I just showed you from the top of the lighthouse. So if you don't really want to build that lighthouse completely, or maybe you want to do something slightly different, maybe your own custom version you do have the giant light for the top of any kind of lighthouse that you can use we have a couple of different lights here as well this looks almost like a desk lamp but it's got a kind of like gold or copper effect to it that's a really really cool one and this one here is essentially a giant red one and it literally does in fact put out like a red beam of light almost so if you're not looking for standard lights and you like to go with things that are slightly different colors that will do that for you because it's red we have ourselves some kind of shelving unit here not particularly exciting that one we've got tons of those in Lego Fortnite. Not bad necessarily, but nothing really that crazy. We've got a storage container here with different things. I think that's supposed to be a book and maybe a bucket, but you can't actually obviously use it for storage, it's just for show. This is a meant to be like a globe anyway. It's the world's most basic globe, I'll be honest with you. It doesn't even have any kind of like images of the world on it. It's just a blue ball on top of a stand, but it's not a bad deck or item. This rug here is also not bad. I can't actually tell if it's supposed to be a kind of like dark red colour and gold, whether it's a light brown, I'm really not sure, but it, to me at least it looks red and gold anyway. We've also got a wall decoration here, again nautical or sort of boat themed, we've got these oars that you can stick on the wall, not too bad that one. We've got a miniature kind of decoration here, which is supposed to be a model lighthouse. Kind of looks a little bit like one, but I wouldn't necessarily say it's that accurate. But then again, it is made of Lego pieces. This one right here has got to be one of the best decor items that you get as part of this bundle. It's basically like a mini wooden ship. There's some quite good ones in this set, don't get me wrong, but this has to be my favourite one. Definitely going to be using that one all the time. We've got ourselves an anchor here that you can place on the floor as a bit of a decoration. I think you have to use metal to build that one. It's okay, but to be honest, I would have preferred something a little bit bigger. We then have these two decorations here, and these are supposed to be like a collection of life rings and life jackets in case you fall into the sea. As you can see, I flipped that one the other way around. Life jacket storage there, and then life rings there, just in case somebody happens to uh, fall into the sea and wash out towards the lighthouse. We've got this one here, which is actually a weather vane. Again, fits with the colours of the lighthouse. Really, really cool, that one. But this one is probably even better. It's literally like a telescope. Definitely going to be using that one. Apart from the boat, I would say that up there with my favourite one. I've just realised that there was another wall decoration as well that I didn't put down. It's this one that you can see here. Not particularly exciting, I wouldn't say. I mean, we've got other stuff that you, you can kind of get like that in LEGO Fortnite already, except this one's got a kind of black edge to it. An okay wall decoration, but definitely not as good as the oars. So there was, in fact, a few more items I forgot to put down as well. I hadn't even noticed these ones because I thought I already had these. I didn't realise they were part of this bundle. So we've got two different chairs here, extremely basic wood ones, as you can see. They look very much like some ones we've already got. That's why I didn't even notice them and we also have two more shelving units here this one automatically has plants on I haven't placed those on there they automatically come with that shelving and we've got this slightly bigger one here which again is not really that exciting kind of like just basic wood items 
So there we have it then people, that is everything that you can get for this bundle from the item shop for a thousand V-Bucks, Lockheed's Lighthouse and all of the decor items there. In terms of a rating out of 10 for this bundle, I'm going to go with a 5 out of 10. I don't necessarily think the value for money on this one is incredible, it's not awful, but a thousand V-Bucks, you only get one build. And you get some good decor items. I would say here there's probably like five to six ones that are really, really good. And the majority of the others are fairly basic. Don't get me wrong, the building itself, the lighthouse is absolutely fantastic. But when you think about the Anarchy Acres bundle, that is 800 V-Bucks. You get three builds and there's probably more impressive decor items with it. So not the worst bundle we've ever had, but I would say probably not the strongest either. And there we go then, people. That is everything that I have got for you in this review right here. I guess I'll see you guys in the next video and peace out.